During our Farm Basics time today, we're going to talk about seed treatments. Well, when we talk about seed treatments, what we're talking about is a coating applied to the outside of the seed. Now, there are a lot of different things that a farmer may want to put on that seed so it's in close proximity to the plant as it starts to grow. Yeah, so those things include fungicide to protect it from disease, insecticide to protect it from insects. There are different biological products that can be added or natural products added to the seed as well. Everything from plant growth hormones to beneficial bacteria and fungi. And one other thing that doesn't get talked about a lot is polymers. Now most seeds have polymers to help coat the seed better. It gives better flowability, so in other words it plants easier, flows out of your truck or flows out of the bag easier. And the other thing is it kind of locks in the dust. Because as farmers, when we're dumping seed into our planters, it's very often windy. And we don't like getting all that dust, the insecticide and fungicide back in our faces. So the polymer helps lock that in and trap it on the seed so it can be more beneficial for the seed and more beneficial for us as farmers. Hey, the other thing, Brian, is plant food. A lot of times we'll see fertilizer or plant food put on the seed too. This is something that in some areas is more common, in other areas they aren't doing it at all. But there, there are just so many different things that could be delivered with that seed at planting time. So one of the things that we hear quite often is, well, it's just a seed coating and it only helps for a little while. But typically when we're talking fungicides, insecticides, there are many of them that are what we would call systemic in the plant. They can move through the plant and they're going to remain in that plant as that seed becomes a plant. So we talk about the seed and seedling protection that these seed treatments can deliver. Usually that's 30 to 60 days. Now for farmers, they'll look at cool season or wet seasons as times where they really want to have a lot of protection out there for their seed because it might have to lay there for a long time in presence of disease or insects. But even in warm and dry areas, farmers are seeing some yield improvement and uh, more plants that emerge evenly throughout the field when they put a seed treatment on. Seed prices have tripled in about the last 20 years and so because the seed prices have gone up so dramatically, farmers really want to have the best protection they can possibly get. That's why they use seed treatments. One other thing that farmers will agree on is weed control is very important for them on their farms. We'll show you how to stop this tough weed later in the show.